lovers out there. We're in the workshop today at the Piano Rescuer's little cute garage, and I'm here with William. What are we doing today? So today I am tuning this very lovely Bill Bajo piano from 1938 with its very unique tuning system. Hey, and here I am. Here I hopped in, I interrupted the show, William. I took over, and here you can see us. We were using a short lever, but William wasn't happy with that. Actually, I was. It just wasn't suitable for the really tight pins for this piano. I actually needed a longer lever just to be able to control the tighter pins more seamlessly. So this Beale uses a very special tuning system which actually has a grub screw in the back. Is that right, Will? Yes, that's correct. All approximately 240 pins have the grub screws at the back, so the tuning will be a lot more stable in the long run. This actually creates a locking mechanism where the tuning pin can be locked in if you want permanently, making the stability of this instrument very good for many years. So you are happy with the tuning today? Yes, it sounds quite pristine. Yes, as we will hear in the background, William is playing a beautiful piece. What is this piece you're playing? I am playing the Du Arabesque 1 from Claude Debussy. So this tuning took us about two hours today. Uh, we took our time, we dialed everything in perfectly. Very happy with the result. And uh, this instrument from 1938 just sounds absolutely fantastic and it proves the Australian build quality of these instruments. So thanks for tuning in and we'll catch you soon. Bye. Bye. Here we are. Hey, it's Will from the Piano Rescuers. I just finished tuning this Bill Bijot right here with its unique iron frame tuning system and it came out nice and lovely. What a beautiful sound. So we say goodbye from our piano workshop. We have lots of pianos we are working on, but this Beal definitely turned out to be a gem. Okay, one more, one more. Give us one more, William. And we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks, guys. Stay tuned.